1250. Press return. Isotope decays predictably. As a result, these numbers change over time. They're the access codes to your drop spot. So what am I now? A spy. Cryptology is the scientific study of encryption or coding messages. It has been used for several millennia. It dates back to ancient Egypt. It was even used by Julius Caesar to deliver confidential messages. The Caesar cipher consists of simply shifting each letter of the alphabet three characters to the left. For example, A becomes D, B becomes E, and so on. This is called a substitution cipher. Cryptography, a part of cryptology, is the process of converting a message from a plain format into a secure format. An example is the application of the Caesar cipher. Original message is known as the plain text. It is easily readable as long as the language is familiar to the reader. Once a message has been encrypted, it is referred to as the cipher text. The process of trying to break the code or figure out the message contained within a cipher text is known as cryptanalysis. During World War II, the Allies used cryptanalysis to decode Nazi messages generated with the Enigma machine. Once this machine's code was cracked, the Allies had a strong advantage. Cryptanalysis relies upon the application of extremely complex mathematics. Many websites use encryption to protect the information you exchange with them. This is indicated by the padlock icon. PG, short for pretty good privacy, is one common encryption scheme. PGP, first released in 1991, is scalable and operates on single workstations as well as corporation-wide. Encryption, a topic most people know very little about, helps to protect important information for everyone each day. Credit card transactions, bank routing, and other tasks are all encrypted.
There is no spoon.